almost on scene. There's definitely smoke, but no visible signs of fire. It looks more like signal flares. Gonna say this is probably a false alarm or a prank. Copy that. You're clear to proceed. Ah, I told you this was a prank. I don't see any fire. <sighs> who in their right mind finds this kind of thing funny? People who enjoy causing a commotion. Huh. Hey, check it out. What in the hell? Hmm. Oh, shit. Can't we just report this one in and go? Come on, man. You know we can't just leave this be. In Japan, 99.9% .9 of criminal trials end with a guilty verdict. That makes the odds for a defense lawyer to get an acquittal about 10,000 to 1. But I beat those odds on a murder case. It's a hell of an achievement. Unfortunately, it came with a price. The death of an innocent woman. The shadows of truth escape the courtroom, and when they do, Someone has to drag them back into the light. The reality is, the law is neither as perfect or as fair as it's supposed to be. So I've made it my job to give those without a voice a chance to be heard. Hit me with some trivia then. That would pass the time. Oh, I mean, come on, man. You never know how long a stakeout's gonna last. Even Keiko chan's losing her mind. I'm sure she is. Give me a sec to come up with a zinger, okay? Okay, sure. You think up a tough question, and I just leave you to your thoughts. Wait a damn minute! How does that even solve this problem then, man? Um, Kaito-san? I don't think I'm really in the mood for trivia at the moment. Okay, fine. We gotta spice this up somehow. So, Keiko-chan, this internet boy, how'd you end up on the raw end of a scam like this? How is this spicing things up? Besides, we don't even know for sure if it was a scam yet, right? Exactly. Kaito-san here is just jumping to conclusions. It'll be fine, Keiko-san. Don't worry. At Yagami Detective Agency, we make sure our clients' hearts are at the heart of our business. <laughs> That's so great to hear. I know I hired just the right people. Damn straight. Sunshine and rainbows with us. Kosuke-kun did say he always eats fast food for lunch. Yeah, but after 20 minutes, I think he'd be done. I don't know. He always makes me worry. Say, Keiko-chan. I wouldn't call it that at all. Would you believe me if I said we took it slow at first? Maybe it's hard for you to see, but he is a caring guy. So he drags you to the shadiest dive. He was just trying to impress me. He, he then could. He sticks his own girl with. The I mean, he is still in call. He said if we didn't pay, they. So they bled you out of eight hundred grand, four hundred. It'd be practically impossible to pay all that in one lump sum. Exactly. That's where Kosuke Kunzi said I could make some easy money working one of. Yeah, 
I'll bet he did. Did he say anything about working? Got this girl, they go out, he racks up a tab. Next thing you know, she's on the same shit, different day in this town. Now you're just jumping to conclusions. Besides, a business taking advantage of- Afraid not. Some lines the law just can't cross until it's- But I do owe you some credit for turning to a man like Gendison. He's been defending this city a long yeah. time. And when things get too dirty for them, Good for you, I guess. Listen, Kikuchi, until you see the- oh, Let's not jump. Speaking of which, <gasps> I'm gonna need to follow him. Hopefully we'll get this all cleared up. <laughs> hey, Tuck, you read me? You gonna be okay tailing this guy? Or do you need the detective basics manual? Kaido-san, please. I could tail him in my sleep. <laughs> the manual says to keep your eyes open, actually. Let's go. What's on the menu today? Probably nothing. Kaito-san, you made contact with a new face. Good call. Kajosan, just set that foot. Yeah, I see. So, who's coasting? That's what I'm gonna try and... Man, I haven't seen you in forever, Sakura-chan. It's because you barely show up to the club events, Kosuke-senpai.
probably wouldn't have seen you today. Sorry, I've just been so busy. I know you've got a lot of girls quit because you stopped showing. Oh, damn. Yeah, that'd be yeah? great. I hope you won't. I don't know if all that in. Yeah? <sighs> wouldn't want that. I'll be careful. Well, okay. I Wait a sec. That's Yagami. He's the detective who reported Anaki's affair to his old lady. Yeah, fuck that guy. Anaki got so pissed he took it out on us. Still fucking sore about it. Yo, Yagami! Just your luck to be passing by us today. Man, this neighborhood never changes, does it?
Get more cash. Status. Not a whole lot right now. He's just wandering around town, pretty much killing time like your average college student. Any idea where he... Good question. Hey, buddy. You new here? You can't just go waltzing in. And why not? Because I said so. Th 